So I never had any plans to talk about the preview pages for this book because I didn't think they would be this epic, but at the end of the month we're getting Power Rangers Unlimited, the brand new Unlimited series that I think we'll be getting every couple of months because this month we're getting uh, the Astromino one where it's the Astromino spin-off. And then in three months, we're getting another unlimited one shot that's about the Phantom Ranger that I talked about earlier today. But the preview pages came out for the Astromino one, and oh boy, it's very a lot to talk about because this took me by surprise. Now, special thanks to Ranger Command for having this on their website so I can show it to you guys because these preview pages that Boom Studios put out are something. So, if you don't want to get spoiled for these preview pages, even though I probably did it in the title and the thumbnail and you just clicked on the video by curiosity, this video will contain spoilers for the first, I don't know, for, I, I don't know what the context for these pages are, but spoilers ahoy. So in three, two, one, spoilers now. So here we have Astromina fighting off rangers, but... Who are these rangers? We've never seen them in Mighty Morphin. We've never seen them in post Mighty Morphin. These are these these rangers are known from the Sentai Flashman. Now, Flashman did make a small appearance in Super Mega Force where they called him the Prism Rangers, but it makes sense that we're seeing Flashman all the way out in space and Astromina is just gutting him down, killing him like a badass. Like, I don't know if I'll go into all these preview pages, but this is freaking amazing. Like, the art on this looks awesome. So, Flashman makes sense depending on how they handle it with their big lore in the um, comic book. Because I believe in Flashman, I could be wrong, they were people from Earth that were abducted by aliens and they were... Uh, experimented on by aliens, then they, were, then they were saved by the Flash race, and the Flash race gave them Sentai powers, and then they became protectors of the universe and went back to Earth. It would make sense that these guys are out in space doing their own things, because um, in the Psychopath, not the Psycho, what was it called? Um, psychotic, the Psychotic um, spin-off that we got, the Psychotic one-shot we got in the year two annual at the end of the Psychopath, we saw the um, five-man rangers, which were the supersonic rangers, doing their own thing. So now the comics has introduced another Sentai-only team, or pre Dual ranger team, and they're off doing their own thing, which is really cool. I do love that, that the comics have been showing their own rangers in the lore. So here's the Stroman, just cutting them all down. And I'm not going to go over too much about the dialogue because it's her fighting him off. And yeah, you just see him be you just see her being a boss, like taking out the green one. Uh, she flips over the pink one and gets caught off guard. So this is like early Astrona that get caught off guard with things like that. But this artwork is freaking amazing and she's stomping on the pink ranger. But I love her final lines here saying... Her point isn't to win, it's to make sure fewer rangers live to see tomorrow. So I love that line. That is a badass line Astromina's got on there. But it's hard to pinpoint when this storyline takes place because she is looking for Zordon. Let's read the um, blurb. So, uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da. I do apologize if, I, if you can hear me sniffling. I've got a bit of a stuffy nose. Um, I remember, okay... It's her true origins and revealed the first, like, it's connected to Mighty Morphin and Mighty Morphin Power Rangers that we're reading now, but I don't know the um, timeline this takes place in, but from what I remember, it's going to connect to Astromina appearing in the upcoming issue 5 of Power Rangers that comes out this Wednesday. So, either way, I'm really excited for these comic, for this comic and the Unlimited series, because if we get different, um characters being told in the Unlimited series, they can explore so much with characters we've, we haven't seen in a while, we haven't met, like, if we're getting the Phantom Ranger in a couple of months, who knows what we'll get, maybe we'll get Ninja or the Blue, the Blue Centurion, how he got to Earth and the Millennial Message and stuff like that, because it seems like these are connecting to future story arcs that Ryan is going to be telling in 
Mighty Morphin. If Ryan is still riding Mighty Morphin and Power Rangers at this time, but it seems like that these comics are telling future storylines will be seeing, will being connected to future storylines will be seeing later down the line. Because Master Viola's teased to appear in the Phantom Ranger one, and if the Phantom Ranger one takes place like in between the season two stuff, then that would make sense for Master Viola to make some sort of sneaky cameo. Because Master Vile has been teased for the longest time in Go Go and Mighty Morphin and a bunch of other Power Ranger comics for the longest time. So who knows what we'll see moving forward. But either way, I'm really excited to read this comic and have my review out when it drops in at the end of March. So if you're brand new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and like the video if you enjoy it. Gotta, gotta say that in a YouTube video. But Anyway guys, what are your thoughts on Flashman or Prism Rangers, whatever you want to call them, making an appearance in uh, this Power Rangers comic? Tell me in the description down below, do you love it, do you hate it? What other Sentai, what, what other pre ju Ranger teams would you like to see in the Mighty Morphin Power Ranger comic books or the Power Ranger comic books? Because... They can do so much. I mean, I know a lot of people want to see Go Ranger from the very first Super Sentai. That would be cool. I would love. I would love to see that. Who knows? But um, either way, I'm really excited to see what they'll do moving forward. And I'm even more hyped for this comic because if we're gonna have a Stromer like slaying Rangers left and right, that's going to lead into her meeting the Omega Rangers. I'm down to see that. But with that said, I think I'm going to wrap this video up. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And yeah, I'll see you guys around. Have a wonderful day or night. Peace out. Take care of yourself. And don't forget to hit those buttons. Bye.